and the gang. What's up, guys? It's been a long time. Shop has been super busy. Sean, uh, and, and you guys, actually, you're getting, uh, what is this, portrait mode today. I ain't got time for the landscape, so this is it. This is your modded Jet City, and it's a beautiful thing. Pretty pumped about this one, actually. Uh, 20 watt head, um, obviously remove the circuit board and perform some mods. Uh, we have some, um, some power amp mainly. So I installed these bias test points. Let's see if I can get you in there. In this lovely PEC bias pot. You want to adjust the bias? You just loosen up this nut here and then you can go ahead and, and adjust your bias. I used the highest quality test points that are available. Look at those guys, they're beautiful. I love them. If I can get it to focus down, I can't. And I reused the uh, some of the adhesive that the prior tech who kind of, uh, who had, I'm not going to say the word botched, but but the guy did damage your your preamp here uh, when he was doing the uh, cascaded gain mods. A lot of the uh, eyelets have been burned off. Uh, a lot of the, the traces were cut on the opposite side of this board as well. So I was able to at least um, melt some of his adhesive over and, and put those things back, the leads back as they were. Uh, because really I'm only uh, doing so many things here. So that's about it, man. And obviously, um, I converted this over to an octal uh, power section here. So whereas you were running six BQ5s or uh, EL84s, you're now running... What? Yes. You're now running EL34s. Some would say a proper power tube. Lovely. Your test points there. I think they look pretty nice. So that's it. I was able to repair your mid-range pot. I had to basically dissect it and then reseat the little uh, resistive strip inside of there, the little wafer, and got all the uh, the contacts tightened up. But she's good to go for certain. And let me see if I can get you a little bit of a sound sample. All right. So I'll just reorient this way so you can get an idea of where the controls are. And there's going to be a little bit of noise here. This is a, as I said before in some other videos, this is a very noisy room. Uh, the chassis is now unshielded, so, uh, and you have some incredibly <laughs> high gain stages set up in a preamp now. And, and not, not the most clever method. It's inducing a lot of noise, but the, the guy was in all fairness constrained to this PCB design. So you're going to hear it, but again, let's, I'll put the gain down let's say nine o'clock that's the master up
go up to 12 o'clock. <laughs> Sound. He's a beast. 